Hey everyone, welcome to today's live stream. Uh, a little bit late, I apologize for that. I got delayed. Uh, seems to be happening a little bit lately, but hey, I'm still here, still streaming. And we are going to be doing some retro Sonic tonight. It's a Sonic game I, for the most part, never really played before. Sonic CD. It's, um, I, I did a couple levels just earlier, just because I've never played it. Just to familiarize, fil can't talk, familiar familiarize myself with the game a little bit and stuff but I only did it for a couple levels so for the most part of this game I'm not gonna fully know what to expect I mean it is a Sonic game so you know little things what to expect but I mean like big things like I don't know the outcome I don't know what like the boss battles are gonna be in and stuff so let's jump into it we are going to have some fun Tails is locked. Hmm. I missed that the first time. And for anybody that doesn't know, this game was uh, released on the Sonic, uh, the Sonic, the Sega CD, which was an attachment for the Sega Genesis. That's why it's called Sonic CD. So I'm pretty sure it was the only Sonic game that was put on the Sega CD. So, so far, it seems to be nothing of relevance in this, just, just a video showing Sonic running fast. It actually seems very similar when I played Sonic Mania, like an intro video there. They, I guess for Sonic Mania, they probably definitely took inspiration from this video. Now, the reason I'm doing this game first, too, before Sonic the Hedgehog 2 even though I believe this one came out afterwards. I'm pretty sure it was like, like a, maybe a year after or something. But for something I read that apparently this game is actually I guess, supposed to take place before Sonic 2. So that's why I was doing it first. But the next retro Sonic game will definitely be Sonic the Hedgehog 2. So Sonic's making his way up to that big ship. I assume that's... Dr. Robotnik's. Alright. Palm Tree Zone. That seems like almost every single Sonic game, your first level has to be like a nice green area. I really would say I was really uncomfortable with that high fall not being in a ball shape because I didn't know what I was going to land on. <laughs> Ooh, speed boots. Uh, do I risk going down the hole? Yeah, let's take a chance. Oh. No! <laughs> oh, I thought I could make it over there. Thought I could make that jump. Try it a second time. I'm not gonna worry about it this time. I've already ended up losing a life for no reason. Past or future? Which one am I going to now, apparently? Because it looks like, I guess there's... Like, Sonic can travel to time zones in this game. I can't go down that hole. Oh, uh, once you hit one of those little signs to either go to the past or the future, then you have to, whoa, oh, I thought I was going to fall off. You have to run really fast a certain speed for a certain while. Oh, I was going to try to see if I can make that jump, but then I realized I was invincible. I see like this, yeah, so I... I I hit one of the signs and I went fast enough, so I don't know if I'm going to the past or the future. Uh, this would appear to be the future, and I thought I was going to die there. Goal. 
All right, well, I guess it's pretty close to the end. Seems, um, compared to other Sonic games I've played, definitely a lot less enemies. Or at least more spaced out. All right, now I can spring safely. Feature already. Well, this is definitely going to help me time travel. Nope, maybe not. Ooh, there's a checkpoint. We're certainly getting the speed. It's getting the distance. There's always something that seems to block me. I noticed in this game, too, when Sonic gets the really fast speed with the shoes, it looks like they added an extra animation to his feet. Hmm. Ooh, thought I was going to hit that spring. Wait, what am I doing? There were those rings. Can I get more? Nope, I guess that's the highest I can get. Ooh, trying to get up on that. There we go. I was trying to get up here, but I guess it was actually nothing. Nope. Collect these rings. I want to jump over the spring. Let's get that force field. I would say I thought I was going to have enough to... Not enough momentum. Let's get this ring up there, and then boom, get this. Rings. Nope. I didn't want to go that far. Oh, there's the goal. Oh, there's a sign telling me there's the goal. Ooh, bonus stage. The zones seem shorter too, I think, compared to at least Sonic 1, that was the most recent Sonic game I played. So what do we have here? Alright. I'm guessing anything that's not looking like pavement, jump over. If I'm supposed to be hitting these things, I appear to be missing, missing them. Oh, I got that one. Yeah, you gotta jump beforehand. Gonna make it over. Oh, miss him. Miss that guy. I don't think I'm getting anywhere with this one. This is reminiscent of one of the bonus stages for Sonic Mania. Like they kind of took the, the way that's almost like a racetrack. But that was different, where you had to chase like a little spaceship thing and collect rings that increased your time. So it looks like for Sonic Mania, they kind of did a variation of the Sonic CD bonus game. Let's see, I can get those rings and come back here. And a nice little spring, so hey, let's go to the top floor. And it looks like we left off the last zone in the future, and it looks like that's where we picked off here. Come on. I'm wasting my invincibility. I'm invincible. I was trying to be like concerned as to what I hit, what I touch, but for the most part, I'm invincible. As long as I don't fall into a pit, I should be fine. Ooh. Alright, yes. Yeah, these zones are very short, because there's a Robotnik boss. Hmm. All right, so I can be bouncing off the string. Can't hit him. All right, he lost one, two. All 
All right, that was a boss fight. Jumping on that like yeah, first Sonic. I was thinking that when I saw like something in the center. That seems a really unimpressive boss fight, I guess. <laughs> It's the first level though too, so maybe they want to give it to you a little easy. Oh, hello. What? What you doing? Besides parting me and apparently running back and forth in front of me. Is that a spike? Oh. Robo Sonic. Technically, I think like Metal Sonic is his name. Ooh, hello, nice force field. So let's get speed. Oh. All right. Wasn't where I was trying to go, but... Ooh, more rings to collect, though. I will take those. Thank you very much. And I believe there was a new force field up here. Eh, well, I'm not gonna worry about those two rings, but. Ooh, that was close. <laughs> I have no idea where I'm going. But. Oh, okay, that's harmful. I say in the end, just inevitably keep going right. That's very weird. There are rings in the wall. Like, how are you supposed to get those? Ooh. Alright, that's a transparent wall. If I'm in the future and it said past, does it actually bring me to the present or does it the past pass? Like how? <laughs> um, it said past again, so I'm guessing this is actually the present. Because I would say, yeah, because technically, well, if you're in the future, then the present would be the past. It's a little chaotic there, bringing me around. Hey, there's the ball. I don't know, this actually might go pretty quick, I think. These these levels do seem short. Alright. Some kind of mini game I guess or something, I'm not sure. weird. <laughs> I guess merely even going back and forth, maybe it was enough it counted as continuous distance. I was able to time travel. Alright, this has definitely got to be like past past, not the present. Which this walkway wasn't open before, so I wonder if you have like, depending on what time zone you're in, time frame I should say, if there are different paths to take then. Like past, present, future, if each one has their own different paths. Nope. I wasn't sure if you could jump on that platform, but I guess not.
<laughs> I got stuck in like a repeating pattern there. Well, that's kind of. Oh, I would say I just ran through Metal Sonic, but I guess it was a hologram. But yeah, it's like a. I was saying that it was a repeating loop there when I was, keep springing off the bumper into the spring. So I gotta keep. Well, I can go through the bottom way, or I can keep apparently bashing my way to the top, or maybe take a shortcut. <laughs> I'm gonna go to the bottom. We'll go back, get some speed from the spring. Nice little jump. Yo, -o jump. I <laughs> didn't know where I was gonna land. Ooh, the goal, and we get another shot at this bonus stage. <laughs> Alright, so we need to jump ahead of time, yes. Damn it. <laughs> I hit something and tripped, otherwise I might have gotten that purple guy. I missed the blue one. Missed that purple one. Damn it. Alright. Oh, I missed him. Well, that didn't last long. It's kind of weird how it says zone like that instead of uh, act like normal Sonic games that, oh, the different sub-segments are called acts. Oh, no, no, no. I don't want to lose all my rings and those friggin' spikes like that. Can I get a force field? No, oh. I thought I was gonna land on the spikes. It looks like there's some kind of barricade there. I must have hit some kind of switch to activate that, I guess. Oh, and I lost it. <laughs> there we go. Get up there. There's a one up. I need the one up. <laughs> I can always use an extra guy if I can get up there. Oh, almost. Almost. Almost made it up there. No, 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 the spikes. Damn those spikes. I currently have no rings, so if I hit the spikes again, I'm doomed, and I thought I was going to hit them. Come on. Oh, yes, thank you. One up. Now I got to... There, almost, almost, almost. Yay, hey, look, I made it up here. And I'm 
hidden Robotnik? Was that it? Seriously? That was the boss fight? That seemed... even easier. Like, getting up to there was more difficult than the actual boss fight. Title Tempest. Oh, I miss. Uh, uh, I guess that's where the title comes in. We're underwater. Miss some of those rings. And I need oxygen. Oh, wait, I got four guys? I must have gotten a one up from rings at some point. All right, I'm guessing down. Missed those rings over there, but there's nothing over here. Yeah, because I've got the one one-up that was on the little console box that I smashed. But now I've got four guys when I had two before that, so I must have gotten a hundred rings at some point and didn't realize it. I'm gonna take a chance to come down here. I was gonna say, so far I haven't encountered any of these little bubble things, but there it is with the hiccup. Oop, hello, secret rings. And nope. Oh can't go to that chamber in the next room. Hmm. Oh. Oh, you... This little thing was so small. I thought the everything else was going down, but this guy was going up. I see, so I've got to... Stay on it like a dead man switch. Hmm. No, that didn't work. All right, so I guess just come up here. Then I don't think I can go underneath it. seems to be a dead man switch and you don't have enough time to kind of get underneath there oh let's not fall off give me a little bubble thank you that pick up Ooh. missed the bubble damn it all right we'll get the next one come on bubble Sonic needs to breathe. Thank you. All right, I wasn't expecting a pipe. <laughs> like Super Mario warping. And there goes my bubble shield. make it up there but the spring helps let's you circle around I'm gonna stay up high as long as I can for now there's the goal 50 rings just enough to give this bonus stage another shot See if we can smash some of these things now. Go a different path. All right. We're doing a little better. Oh, I missed that guy.
see if we can take a shortcut. So we got one blue, one purple. That's better than I did before. Alright, so title Tempest 3, and looks like that's gonna force us to keep moving forward. I'm assuming this is a race against time level, perhaps. Didn't give me a bubble. I have no idea what floor or level. It looked like there's different levels to go on. Is this the same one? I think this is the same one I was on before, actually. There's our shield. And then I jumped up here, and this is where I died because it didn't give me a bubble. No? Oh. Up. Oh. All right. Point. I thought for sure I was going to actually get hit before I hit him. Dragonfly. Ooh. I thought I was going to hit by one of those little fireball things, but I guess not. Sure, what these buttons are doing, but I'm hitting them, and there goes the force field. What the <laughs> Sonic starts off teetering on the edge. Good thing I grabbed the ring. Stupid enemy. What's up here? I was hoping for like a force field or something. I will take the rings though. Oh wait, do those not hurt you? Maybe that's why I thought I was going to get hit by them. Oh, I see. So if I hit that, and then I can spring up here. And this might be an alternative way to go, which is probably a lot safer than what I was doing before. Is there a break in these? Oh, I see. Yeah, they don't hurt you, but they seem to push me forward. I still have no clue where I'm going. <laughs> nice, thank you. One up. Wait, wasn't this three? No Robotnik fight? Oh no, it's zone two. I thought it was three. <laughs>
All right, let's try this. Missed him. Damn it. Awesome. Hey, how are you doing? Thank you for stopping by. I appreciate that. Oh, I missed that purple guy. Got him, though. The little air vent got me flying, so I couldn't hit the blue one. And missed that purple. Got you, though. I'm going so fast I can't get lined up with him. <laughs> Got the blue, one blue, that other blue. There was a purple, come on. Did I get them all? Yes, I finally got one of these bonus stages. This is like, what, the third, fourth time? My first Chaos Emerald. Or apparently they're time stones in this game, not KS Emeralds. But yeah, awesome. Uh, how are you doing? And once again, yeah, thank you for stopping by. I'm being very cautious as I don't know what to expect. I figured there's something hidden in there. <laughs> Can I... Like get at the edge. Try to see if. Nah. Just dropping by. How's it going? Um, I'm doing good. Just playing this Sonic game. I've never actually played this one before. Sonic CD. Glad you're doing good. Oh, I totally was not paying attention. There's a Robotnik there. What the? I. I have obviously I have no rings, but there are rings. I assume. I'm supposed to keep up with him in this maze and hit him as I go along, like that. Ooh. Invincibility, can I get down there? I wanna, yeah, get down the hole without losing it. Now where is this punk? Oh, he's got a big head start. Oh. Nice, did I get him, or no? Oh, he's smoking now, I've got him. <laughs> Whenever I can actually catch up to him, he's kind of zooms ahead. Oh, so what was that, a boss fight before the boss fight, or...? I have no bubbles I can breathe in here, apparently. Or... Oh, I say, okay, I can breathe the big bubbles he's making here. I'm assuming... I gotta break these bubbles. And then, once I... Get the ring, get the ring, get the ring. But he seems to keep replenishing his bubbles. So how does one get in there to hit him? Ooh, okay, I only needed one shot, and I guess he didn't replenish all the bubbles in the end. These boss fights overall do seem unusually easy, I don't know why. I might actually have to switch over to uh, something else because this game's going a lot faster than I thought. Um, let's take the high road. Ooh. Those guys were in Sonic 1, I believe. A variation of them, at least. Going back down, I would say the low road, but I guess the middle road. What the? I hit something. Alright, <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. 
He doesn't have spikes on him. That's what's different. I think the ones is Sonic 1. You had guys that were inchworms like that, but everything except for the head had spikes on them. Robo Spider. Thank you, Mr. Checkpoint, and I'll grab these rings. And I'll almost die. Mr. Ring. And you know I've got to take that high road again. Just to apparently go back down to the low road. <laughs> the very low road. I was considering jumping down the hole, but I will avoid that for now. I would kind of say with Sonic, it's a lot of times it seems there's more secrets on the higher path, usually, but not guarantee. Can I? get in there? Yeah, I want those rings. <laughs> I was being greedy, wanted the rings. Oh. Well, now we're on the bottom. And, oh, he does have spikes, actually. That one. <laughs> That's like barely any momentum. Still managed to keep going. Oh, I think this is like a conveyor belt, isn't it? That's why I had a continuing momentum a little bit. Um, invincibility, and we'll keep going left. I can't get those without falling down, but I want to see what's over here. Hmm. Some rings that I won't be able to get. Ooh, good thing I was in ball form. I believe I can go up. Nope. Let's get a big jump. Ooh, I see rings. There's rings there. middle path, I guess. Oh, come on. <laughs> yeah, you friggin' die. I want rings. I want to see if I can get another one up. I need, what, 28? Probably not likely to get one. Not that many, I don't think. But you never know. I'm already at 82, so. Ooh, to the bottom. Nope. Probably not likely. Yeah, there's the goal. Ah, unless I go this way. 
Nope, I guess I went too far. That's as far as I can go back. 88, so I was 12 away from getting another one up. That's a little bit of a shame, but... Let's see if I can get another, apparently, time stone. Ooh. These guys are moving a little faster. Oh, okay. So if I'm, like, floating from the air venting, I can still hit them. What's that? A weak jump, and I totally missed him. Get Mr. Blue. Nope. Oh, I missed him, too. <laughs> Miss that one. Miss him. <laughs> Come on, I'm missing every single one of them. Ooh, he like just dodged me at the end. <laughs> nope. Total failure. <laughs> Not a single one of those little robot drone things. Hey, there's the one-up I was looking for earlier. I had a little voice called Sonic. He went, yeah! Ooh, I missed some rings. Oh. Now, I was wondering if this could be like a continuous loop thing, but I guess... Not... Because there's a big enough gap that you seem to fall through it. Oh, Robotnik fight. Alright. I can't move forward. I'm assuming you don't want to get hit by that. So how am I supposed to attack him? Not like that, apparently. Can I? Nope. It was worth a try, I assume. Hmm. Get out of the spike. Nope. I decided to try that, but... Nope, that doesn't work either. No spin dash. So I have no clue how to attack him. Oh, you know what? I was going to say, it maybe get close to these spikes and do th that thing, does it blow up this, which in turn maybe shuts off the conveyor belt, and I'm out of rings, <laughs> and now I'm dead. Hmm. Okay, so this one's now certainly, I think, the trickiest fight. Luckily, there's still one up there I can get. I missed that invincibility, but I really have no clue what was going on with this boss fight. I don't think it has anything to do with this. Damn it. There seems to be no checkpoints, so as long as I can I can keep getting that one up, so I can keep having infinite tries apparently. 
Yeah, it has nothing to do with that. If I stay as close to Robotnik as possible, that doesn't attack him, so I have no clue. Or maybe just got a... Hey, Shinobi Nando, thank you for stopping by. And I thank you so much for the hello, even though it's a quick hello. <laughs> and your little throwing stars. So one thing I can think of is it seems like Robotnik, every once in a while, kind of goes a little lower. Maybe he ends up destroying his conveyor belt, and then you can attack him. And I just got to do a waiting game. Yeah, this is a Sonic game I've never played before. So I'm not exactly sure the pattern of this boss. But yeah, it might be just a, a waiting game. See, I had my emote made as a ninja purposely so I could pretend to throw it. Oh, and I got hit. <laughs> no, that's cool. Yeah, I really like the stars and they look nice. But yeah, you see like how he kind of... Oh, no, it's not that he lowers himself. I think the conveyor belt is grinding away at his device. So yeah, I think it's just a waiting game. I think in this case, you don't actually attack him. It's just a waiting game. Because it's uh, the conveyor belt. Yeah, you see his feet. He's starting to panic now. Ooh, that was so close. <laughs> that I actually give uniqueness for. I've never seen that with a Robotnik boss fight where you don't attack him whatsoever. And you like he ends up destroying himself. You just have to outlast him. A waiting game. Interesting. Uh, that's definitely... Different than any Robotnik. What do we got? Wacky. Did it say Wacky Quarterback? It was Wacky something. I missed what the zone was called. Oh, good. So I missed these rings. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Yeah, it's definitely. I was. I. I. It's a good thing there's a one up earlier in the level, so I, I kind of evened out like every time I didn't lose any guys. But I just, I wasn't sure, why am I not getting any momentum? There we go. I want that ring. But yeah, it was like there's no way to attack him, and that's because you weren't supposed to. He damages himself. Oof. I thought I was going to miss that platform. Hmm. Oh. Oh, wow, okay, I thought that was harmful to land on. I guess not. The floor is okay. It's like a super sprint. <laughs> nope. I didn't think I was going to make it through there safely. Oh, no, no, not again. <laughs> so I guess that's the hazard of the super spring floor. Because you don't necessarily know what's going to be on the ceiling. Oh, and I missed the platform. Is this Mania Plus? No, no, no. It's um Sonic CD. Got to get up there from this platform. I've never played Sonic CD before, so this is something new that, that's like one, one classic Sonic game I never played. Yeah, I'm playing it on the Xbox 360. And now I'm not sure where to go either. <laughs> I keep... 
jumping. There we go. There's some place new. Overall, though, I have the. Ooh, okay, that electrifies. Nope. Not where I wanted to be. But I would say, yeah, that it's the, the boss fights have overall seemed really easy compared to other Sonic games. I'm not sure where this guy is going. Checkpoint, thank you. Ooh, alright, I guess I hit another checkpoint. That's kind of cool. Except you can only go up so high because <laughs> there's a wall there. I thank you for your rings. Alright, I think I'm going to someplace new. There's no spring or anything to get up there. Aw, damn it. But in the end, for the most part, a Sonic game, if you don't know where to go, try to keep going towards the right. But yeah, you can only go up so high. Because then you start hitting the ceiling and you couldn't bring that thing up through that gap anyways. Uh, no, that's not what I want to do. Ah, damn it, now I'm back up here again. Alright, take it back from my original statement. That spring floor is annoying. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> no. I don't think I want to be up here because I think this is where I, I came last time. That's where I died, actually. Get down, down. No, not up, down. <laughs> I'm going to die again, aren't I? <laughs> No, stop springing me up. <laughs> Get on the platform. All right, down or up? I'm gonna try down. All right, this is someplace new, so. I do believe I'm finally making some progress. I thought that was a checkpoint. No, 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 no. This is a big electro net thing, for lack of a better term, but let's hit that checkpoint. No, oh, I thought it was going to land on a spring platform. If 
I can get down here, I will take you, Mr. Force Field. Nope. I do not want to go up high. And bye-bye, Mr. Force Field. Goal! Yes, finally I made it to this level. That one almost kind of felt like a nightmare. <laughs> that spring floor is real nuisance. It would just throw you everywhere. Alright, so we got number three, the final act of the zone. That's a lot of rings. Uh... I'm not going to make that jump. <laughs> I realized I should have jumped too sooner as I pulled back because I'm like, not going to make it. Thankfully, I landed on a platform because I didn't make that jump to that platform. I am guessing I'm supposed to say when to let go. Oh, you stupid spider that looks like a street lamp. <laughs> oh, I was rolling in a ball. Come on. No, 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 no. I tried to pull back to get that. Well, that's kind of cool. That is not cool. Oh wait, there's something up there. I th thank you for your service. Ooh, narrowly avoided that fire. Not fire, the freeze thing. Alright, so we want to go... Not that direction. <laughs> Damn it, I'm not getting my timing right. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> There we go. Much better. We'll get on this platform. Land on here. Jump on Mr. Bumblebee. That looks like a robot Bumblebee. Damn it. <laughs> Keep going the wrong way. <laughs> I can't get through there, can I? Nope. Oh. Oh, okay. Apparently, it looks like I can actually jump out of that fo ice thing. Because I didn't take damage. I didn't lose my force field. Like that, yeah, you can jump out of it. I didn't realize that at first. Let's get another force field. Alright, this is... Actually, that was kind of weird. What did I hit last? Am I time traveling to the future or the past? I'm assuming this is the future. Um, no, apparently that was not the way to go. Oh. <laughs> 
I do believe I am making progress again. I knew I was going to get hit by that thing. Alright, let me through. Well, I was in the future, so I only have one choice to go to the past. Which I assume means back to the present. No Robotnik fight? That one? Oh, because that's zone 2. Why do I... I did it in the last one, too. Didn't I? I keep thinking zone 2 is zone 3 for some reason. <laughs> I was also wondering why it seemed long, because these Zone 3s in this game don't seem like a very major setup. You know, it seems like very quickly to get to the boss fight. Alright, let's do a YOLO. YOLO does nothing. We need to get up on these higher platforms. And I'm guessing... To the left. But then this just brings us back down, doesn't it? No, but I guess I wasn't here because there's a lot of rings. Well, not a lot of rings, some rings. But now this is back to where I was. Oh, wait, hello. How did I not see you before? I can hit the right spot. I was trying to get there's like a little cubby hole thing, but let's keep going to the right. Can't go up, so we go down. Yolo jump. All right, yeah, don't jump into the fire. Don't get hit by whatever falls down. <laughs> oh, I guess the little guys are okay. I have no rings. And I was supposed to get to that higher level, wasn't I? Get the stuff on the left, we will just go right. Oh, almost missed it. Is there enough for a one up? But nope, not enough for a one up. 
Alright, so that does nothing. The little guys are nothing, but we gotta get on the big guys. Didn't quite make it up there. Alright, so we can't attack him again. This is another case of... Don't get hit by the falling stuff. And we gotta outlast him. I gotta pay attention to which one goes higher. Watch out for the... Lost my rings. What the? Hmm. That appeared to be the top. So what do we? Where do we go from there? Oh, I totally fell off. <laughs> I missed a couple rings. Alright, so bring it on, Robotnik. Yeah, I say it's more than likely not going to be the one I land on because I want to make you make that extra jump. Oh, you can actually jump through the bottom. I thought you had to jump through the little gap in the center. This one has... the lag mites. Oh! No, 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 no. Okay. So once you get... Once you get to the third one, you don't want to get on the high level one. I see. See now. Question is though, so where does the attack come from? Or how does it get damaged and beaten? Oops. Oh well. No, no, actually I guess I get another try. Oh not quite. No, this is right, yeah. But I don't need all these rings. Oh, hello. Are you kidding me? All this time there was a one up there that I was missing? <laughs> I gotta remember that. It seems to be a relatively easy one up. In the third act. This game definitely seems kind of very generous, I can say. That it gives you, like in the third act, it seems there's always a one up that you can keep hitting in order to almost have infinite tries. Yeah, you keep smiling, Robotnik. I'm gonna get you this time. So the third floor is 
This leads up to the ceiling. So this time I want to be on the lower one. Yeah, because it's right before the stalag, or right where the stalag mics are. And now I'm out of rings. Nope. <laughs> and so I jumped. God damn it. Alright. Out of like kind of instinct panic, I thought I was going to be on a top one. And I jumped. forgiving too. This particular zone, most of the platforming is forgiving. I don't need that ring. However, I will. If I can make my way over there. Get this one up. Not where I'm trying to go. I'm trying to just get that one ring. Not this one ring. One ring to rule the ball. Forget that ring. <laughs> I can grab these rings though. One more, there we go. All right, Robotnik, time to get your ass. I don't know, does it actually do damage? Because he seemed to be, or is it just because he was flying away? He was angry. And I wasn't intending on getting hit there. Yeah, it seemed to kind of make the sound. Maybe I am supposed to keep walking him. It kind of makes that sound and he gets the angry face but it doesn't have the flash. Thing. So we want... Yeah, we want one that goes lower. All right. Where are you running to? That was weird, because like usually when you hit him, he kind of flashes white to indicate a hit. So I guess you actually did have to keep hitting him as you went up. And then once you got to that top zone, you have to be on one of the lower ones to keep hitting him. And why is my... My microphone volume seemed to get really low, I don't know why. How's that? That, that? That's a lot better. Okay, I don't know what was going on. It was weird. It seemed to get quiet for a second. And I thought that was a safe platform. Neither is that safe. Damn you. <laughs> Alright. Well, I seem to bypass a lot of the level there, but I missed a lot of rings. <laughs> now I'm really too hot for a level. How's it? That's better. I was not even paying attention that I was running. I'm running backwards. Am I supposed to be going this way, or...? Hello. Got 
guy. Dang, Spike. Alright, I have no clue where I'm going. I keep saying that, but it's true. No spring, but there are springs up there. I got springs, rings, I meant to say. So I'm taking this is back in the present. A giant green eyeball. <laughs> Alright, some invincibility. Now this is a repeating loop. <laughs> hmm. Alright, a checkpoint is a good sign. That's not a good sign. <laughs> nope. I'm back to where I was here. That spring is there, so that's not going to help me. I go in between here. I believe this is gonna shoot me off. When in doubt, get in a ball. <laughs> Go. Let's go underneath here, get some rings. Kind of auto, I was auto doing that level now, but there we go. Oh, hello. Wait, there was something over here. Force field. Too bad it's not like double the force field, you know, if you hit a second one. <laughs> Doesn't work like that though. Nope. Let's get some speed going on. Ah, oh, stupid spike. I didn't see you, you kind of blended in with the background. Twice you got me, yeah. Uh, punk.
we get enough speed going on. This is a little better, I think. Nope. Yeah, because this is where I wanted to be. Yeah. Nope. Yeah, stop. No! That's <laughs> getting annoying. There we go. Right, how hard was it to get up there, Chief? Hmm. Stupid spikes. That's not where I want to go. Appear to be stuck somewhere. I trying to get it right to jump on that other platform like that. Okay, going down here was an answer. Let's try down here. Because that spike was really so helpful. So I do believe I am making definite progress. <laughs> I have no... No clue. I'm just kind of going somewhere. Go, oh, hey, I made it. <laughs> I keep stop bouncing off the spring. That one was definitely kind of like a real maze of a level. Very nice of them to start me off with some rings. Oh, hello, there's the one up. Question is, how do I get up there? I would say this thing. I thought that was a moving platform, but it is not. Can I? Bye. get as much speed as I can. 
There we go. That might be. I actually sprung up. I was trying to first get on the top of the ramp. Nope. Damn it. Too early. That might be how to get the one up. Well, not quite what I was looking for. Yolo, nope. Hmm. Ah, over here. Okay. I wasn't sure if that would actually be enough jump. Alright. There's Metal Sonic and Robotnik's flying around like a jack-off shooting lasers. Okay, so... I can't attack him, I'm assuming race. Ooh, he got electrified. Hey, that's no fair, I can't produce electricity. The little metal punk. Oh, grab the ring, grab the ring. No! Oh, and I get hit by a Robotnik's laser. Damn you. At least I know how to get the one up now. Let's try that again. We'll get ramp for momentum. That's better. Can I? No. I say I can't get enough speed to get a hit on Robotnik. I notice they conveniently wait enough time, so even if you manage to get there with the speed boots, it's enough time that it's gonna wear it out before the race actually starts. Ooh, I wonder if that's a shortcut up above. Nope. I was doing good. Nope. Damn you. <laughs> nope. Nope. Oh, screw you, Robotnik Laser. Alright, I'm getting better with this race, but at least again, yeah, there's that one up, so I have infinite tries. I almost gotta like keep jumping because it seems like I I, I managed to avoid everything. Let's try up above, if that was a shortcut, I don't know. I, don't, I guess not. Oh, 
Okay, there are more rings I can get as it goes along. That's nice, too. Oh, that was the finish line, apparently. I assume. I bet if I get there, Robo Sonic, Metal Sonic gets locked out, and he probably gets destroyed by the beam. Too far. I over jumped these guys. Yeah, because I got here with the speed boots, but there's enough time that it. You know, it's gonna wear off before the race begins, because that would definitely be unfair advantage for Sonic. Oh, damn you. Oh, I almost got hit by him. Nope. I keep getting caught there. I have no rings. I got a ring. But I don't think I'm going to make it. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh! If I didn't jump, if I didn't jump, I would have got it. <laughs> I thought there was going to be another hazard. I tried to jump and then I got like caught up by something hanging. Like a little piece of the, the background there that was hanging. Alright, you uh, cheap metal imposter. Aw, I thought I was gonna avoid that hit, but. Damn it. Missed that jump with the spikes. God damn it, no! <laughs> I had no momentum and I went back down into the laser. Thank this generous game though for the infinite tries though. I really should have done that better. So, when I'm up against it, There we go, I avoided that hit, but I would say when I'm up against it, I get slower momentum starting. If I'm too far back, he gets the advantage. Oh, I saw he was electrified, and I'm like, God damn it. I hate you. Come on, you bastard, no. No, 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 no. Yes, I got it. <laughs> I was pretty sure that was the end, and I'm thinking, like, don't jump, don't jump, don't jump. Oh, Sonic's little girlfriend there. Amy, I believe her name is. One, just one hug is enough. Yeah, there was, when I said I was trying out the levels earlier, like the first zone or something like that, once you get fast enough to do that time traveling thing, I laughed because the achievement unlocked it said, uh, hit 88 miles an hour. I thought that was so hilarious, like a Back to the Future reference. 
All right, not off to a good start. Ooh, I saw that little bugger's got a bug buzz saw on his head. No, 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 no. His buzzsaw was hidden in the background. I didn't see it until I started jumping. I don't think I can destroy one of those guys. Joker lover, thank you so much for the cheer. I appreciate that. How are you doing? Ooh. I hate falling down like that because you don't know where you're going to land. I uh, see if I don't get killed first. No, I want that ring, but I was there's that checkpoint, but I want the rings. I'm pretty sure this is this might be the last level of this game. Checkpoint. At least I hit the checkpoint before I died. Give me them rings. Ooh, almost got caught in there. Nope. I pulled back when that little stick thing was coming. <laughs> then I had no momentum and I fell back down underneath the platform. That was at least better. I'd rather to take the hit than get crushed and die. Hmm. Oop. Almost fell down there. I'm always tempted to go higher. Checkpoint, thank you very much. Nope, no, no, I don't want to go that far back. Another checkpoint. Yay, that set me back. <laughs> I go from a greater checkpoint to a lesser checkpoint. goal, so I guess I ended up in the right place in the end. Yeah, it's not bad for a Sonic game, but overall, yeah, it just feels like the, the levels are kind of short, and the boss battles... Some of them have been a little creative, but at the same time, they overall felt maybe a little too easy, but this game was probably just rushed to get it out for the Sega CD, so they had a Sonic game on there. Because they had just worked on, like it came out, like I said, after Sonic. Thank you for the spikes there. It came out after Sonic 2, and they were probably working on Sonic 3, so I'm sure our Sonic team was really busy. Ooh, I didn't think I was going to make that jump. Can I? Oh, didn't know if I can get up there. And time it right. That was not timing it right. Thank you once again, Spikes. <laughs> Much better. I'm gonna keep going up. No! Oh, we said it landed on the spikes again. I had no rings this time. Come on. Now. Nope. Now. Let's just keep going to the right. 
Oh. I said I saw a checkpoint up there, but now I can't get back up. That was a big fall. Hmm. Uh, sprung up into the spikes. <laughs> Oh, wow, that was a big boost, okay. This is, I think, where I left off, actually. And YOLO! Oh, so you can make it up there, okay. Son of a bitch! I thought I could slip in there, but I didn't have enough space. Thankfully, this game has saves. <laughs> that was a close call. <laughs> Trying to slip through that gap. Almost hit those spikes. Good enough. Nope. YOLO no work there. Give me a ring. Give me a checkpoint. Don't get crushed. <laughs> oh, almost hit that spike. <laughs> All right. So word of advice, don't jump on that big guy. Do I? Oh. That, maybe? There we go, okay. Up, down, left, or right. Up. Um. I don't know, did I do anything? <laughs> Checkpoint. That's something good. Damn it, I can't spin ball into those guys either. Alright, so avoid the big bomb dudes altogether. And I need a little button that triggers that gateway, I assume. Or to take another path. If I can avoid the spring. That's not the path I want to take. Orange eyeball. Hmm. Guess I can't get up there. Oh, you know what? Oh, I was going to say for a second, was this one of those little stair things? 
Oh no, this is a walker, okay. This is not Sonic Mania. That's how you get up there, you walk this guy. Over to this platform and then you can make the jump. Once you avoid the little bomb explosion. Oh, you... He's gone. Hey, I got too far off screen. All right. I'm not going to be able to destroy this, am I? Take the hit. Oh, it's a shrinking ray. That was in Sonic Mania 2. Oh, this, maybe this is one of the Sonic Mania levels? I don't remember. So now I'm like, I shall call him Mini Sonic. You'd think he'd be able to fit through that gap. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> There's no spring over here. This is the only way up. There we go. Oh, I had it and then I lost it. No. There we go. Hmm. Oh, I didn't think I could make that jump. Mini Sonic does look kind of cool. He needs to find himself a Mario Super Mushroom. Trying to... Oh, it's a simple jump. I thought you had to jump off there. I was making it a lot more complicated trying to get up there to get those rings. Um, I guess I'm going to go down. This was not the answer, because now I'm back here again. Alright, so, yep, go through here. But this is back to where I was, wasn't it? Hmm. No, how did I not get killed? Crushed in there. That time I got crushed. <laughs> what a way to go. Oh, and I forgot the walking thing.
Lost my checkpoint. Actually, I guess this isn't being too bad, though. I was trying to jump up on the same platform! I don't believe that. That was me, that was because I tried to get greedy and go back for the ring. Rings. this way instead. Mrs. Pasta Lover, gotta move your head ever so often when your game is transitioning. I think you are frozen. Sorry. I will move my head a little more often for you. I apologize for that. Yeah. I know I'm kind of like focused staring at the screen, so... Ooh, fell down. Not good. And how are you doing, Mrs. Pasta Lover? Thank you for stopping by as well. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> Oh, I was thinking you gotta jump up there. It's in the middle. Like, how many times have I gone through this already? No, don't get crushed by it that time. Shouldn't have jumped up there. On the screen, you are playing on posted up on the ceiling. Oh, is the screen you are playing on posted up on the ceiling, I think you were saying? Oh, no, um... The TV you're talking about, the one I'm playing off of, it, it's on a stand, so it's I, I do kind of have to look upward a little bit because it's up higher from where I am with the chair. And it's a little distance away, like a couple of feet, so. But I'm playing off uh, my TV. I'm just giving you a hard time. It's no problem. Alright. Let's time this jump and... Not now. <laughs> now. Come on. Get it. There you go, on the platform. Didn't quite make it. Oh, well, we'll keep going this pattern. I didn't want to fall down there. So far, this level, I think, has been the most difficult one I've had so far. Nope. Keep laying on the spikes. I think this might actually be the last level of this game, too. It went by really quickly. Quicker than I thought. No, don't get crushed. <laughs> Come on. 
Come on, come on. Don't hit the spikes. Got those rings. Nice, nice, nice. Get out of the way, this bomb. Alright, so up. Didn't do anything. I believe it was left the last time I came here. I don't know if that does anything, but I'll hit that. Conveyor belt. Ooh, thought I could avoid it. Not on the hill. Can't get through there, that's right. So I had to go down. No, nope, go down. Ooh. Stupid orange eyeballs. <laughs> In this walking device. Oh, I thought I was safe there. I was wrong. Now we are mini Sonic again. Get no, I don't want to jump there. I want to get up there and get those rings. Yes. No, because this is just where I was. So what if I... Can't go this way, there's nothing over here. I ended up dying somewhere in here before, and this is, I think, the farthest I had gotten. Because then it just seemed to kind of loop back around again. Because I can't get up here at all, so the only way to go is down. What if I go this way? All right, this is something different. And apparently there's actually nothing. Oh, I'll say nothing here, but I can go through there. Now I'm big Sonic again. Nope. <laughs> I've got the fast shoes. Progress. How many layers we got? I guess that's it. Goal! Hey, this level's done. That one gave me a little bit of trouble.
I am not going to be able to get all these rings, am I, without getting hit. Gotta be good with your jump. I'm not even going to try, because I know I'm going to get hit. I want to know what's up here, besides some spikes I saw. Well, guess I'm not going to find out. <laughs> want to be on this end. Oh, all right. This is kind of springy all around. Oh, there's no bottom. Alright, that gets dangerous because there's no bottom in that area. Hey, I made it up here this time. Sweet. Ooh, one up, one up. That was worth losing the rings. And I walked right into a saw. Aw, uh, there was a ceiling, I couldn't jump over him. Nope, 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 nope. Whew, that was luck. Alright. Oh, there's spikes there. Um, okay. I was saying, <laughs> they just kept coming. I don't get what this spinning device does, or do I? I thought it was something that you like. You got to run around and kind of move it up, but maybe I got to just up oh, standing in it. That does nothing. Oh, I see. It's just kind of like a turn style kind of thing. Oh, and then I'm behind the level. All right, that's what makes it safe. I was going to say, there's no way to get around. Ooh. And then once it's on the other side, I have to do it again so I get back in the front. I see that. That's, that's, that's kind of clever. Like that, yeah. Okay. Not sure what to do there. See if I can get this without losing rings, but I guess not. <laughs> So we're back on the low path, eh? No! <laughs> I was afraid I was going to get caught underneath that platform. That was close. Once it all went wrong, I thought I was going to hit spikes. Yeah. 
Almost, almost. Oh no, I want to stay on the higher level. But I should be able to make it back up here now. Don't. All right. <laughs> I say don't jump to the left or the right. Just kind of go straight up. But I'm stuck now because I I need to jump off the spikes to get up there. So close. <laughs> it's one of these things again. Or actually, no, this is where I was before. It was a high row, you just kind of, I think, like you, you fall down instead of going up at the end like I did. But it brings you to the same place. I have a force field, but... I don't think I can attack this guy. I shouldn't have run into that one. I thought I would have been safe. That little robot firefly, I have no idea how to t take him out. Alright, I'm gonna get you... Obviously, I was going to get you without losing rings, but I guess that's not the case. Yeah. And I went right into the saws again. But I'm not going to make the same mistake with this guy, except I did, because jumping on the hill made me go backwards. Yeah, they just, you just kind of end up in the same spot anyways. No! Oh, thank you for that save. Well, I got in there quickly. <laughs> so I'm back here, but yeah, how do you fight the firefly? Yeah, so I can't hit him. Ooh, I thought he was going to hit me. That time he did. Does he burn himself out? I don't know what to do. Because he doesn't seem to be wearing down anytime soon. That did nothing. Hmm. How do you make YouTube videos of your playthrough? 
Oh, do you make videos of playthrough? Um, yeah, I upload all my streams to my YouTube channel. Uh, I use that as an archive. So all my past live streams are on YouTube. I don't do any editing, really. Uh, I don't have time for that, so I just throw up the live stream as it was. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, I really don't know what to do, though. He's not seemingly wearing down. Yeah, I'm just kind of going right through him. Oh, I see. Wait. When he f fires. Yeah, that's what it was. I noticed that. Oh, now there's two of them. No. As he fires, he's not flashing like he's phases through matter. There you go. It took me a while to figure out. I'm going to say, I knew that would be some kind of trick. You sound like the guy who does some um, Legos and YouTube vids. By the way, you talk and explain the game as you go. Oh, uh, I hope that's a good thing. But yeah, it's, um, I've never done any Lego videos, so it's definitely not me. Alright, let's figure out this fight. Nope, no, give me ring. Okay, so I can touch these walls. Not what I wanted to do. Again, not what I wanted to do. I actually like this, it's like with the this Sega CD music, it's the Sonic 1 boss music, but it's kind of upgraded a little bit, because it had the CD quality music. No! I died. At least I know what to do now. That's not what to do. Yeah, it's a good thing. I know... You... Oh, no, it's not you, silly. Um, just saying your mannerisms and how you talk, the game you to play. Well, thank you, then, for the compliment. I appreciate it. Well, hopefully if all goes well, you know, you'll hear my voice a lot more things down the road. A little longer than I kind of hope, but... Oh, I forgot about them saws. And then I just jumped into him again. That's tough to get around that guy because you you have no momentum jumping forward on a hill. Oh, that was so much luck. Come on, come on, come on. rings. Oh, I thought that was too soon. <laughs> when it was going to rotate me around. Almost got him. Come on, go low. No. I'm out of rings. Oh, no, 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 no. Still can't avoid, unless I'm invincible, I can't avoid getting that without taking a hit. What the hell was I just thinking? <laughs> uh, 
I have to take. I think this is a slightly longer way, so we'll have to unfortunately take this now. Come on down. Thank you. Grab these rings while I'm here. Nope. Thanks for the save again. And I lost it. Saved that a couple times, but then lost it. Alright. Get. Oh, I made it, finally! Without getting hit. Gotta get going, have you on work, have a great stream. Thank you very much, thank you for stopping by. I hope you have a good night too. If you stream, I hope you have a good stream. In fact, I always keep forgetting I have this command. You are gonna get a shout out, Mrs. Pasta Lover. Make sure I get your name spelt right. There we go. Thank you for stopping by and thank you for your work. I appreciate that. <laughs> Aw, and then I got hit. No, you're absolutely welcome. I thank you for all, all the support you give. Am I safe to go down there? Yes. Oh, it's like, um, however, oh, as I was going to lose it, but nope. Get in there. I'm going to go try to stream. It's been over a week. It has been? Uh, <laughs> I was kind of out of loop a little bit for my phone and then going to work and stuff. Well, have a good stream. I hope you're feeling better today, too. I remember you said you weren't feeling good yesterday. Bye. See you later. Come on, little floating spikies. I'm pretty sure... Yes, I was going to say I lost track, but I was hoping that was going back. Too soon, too impatient. Let's try to save that as a backup if I can. Oh, almost got you. Come on. I gotta do it like almost as he's shooting. Come on, come on. I was gonna get him. Got him. I've got no rings though. Oh no 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 no. They're like one hit kill, yet they're very tricky because you just got to get that timing right. Well, there's my hit with the rings. Still worth it for the get the one up. Oh. Come 
Get in there! Nice! Alright, okay, we got back here a lot quicker. Got you, you punk. Come on, no. I was thinking I was getting a little too impatient. No, 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 no. Well, I got, finally got that extra ring. Uh, fine, we'll take the long way. No! <laughs> that was a really high pitch, no. to go. Right here, I think. No, that's not the safe area. Screw it. I'll take the long way. And I jumped into the spikes. Why? I have no idea. Dude! Didn't think I was gonna make that. Here, Mr. Firefly. Oh, well, it's not even close, I guess. Got you. Got one. Ooh, so close. I was good on timing, but I'm not good on distance. Oh, come on! Got him! Give me those rings. Three rings. Alright, Robotnik. We're gonna do this the hard way. No, we are not. <laughs> oh, I was trying to time that right. Like, get the open space. <laughs> I 
<laughs> so I got hit on the way out. Why do I keep forgetting about that? Ooh. No, 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 no. No! <laughs> oh my god. It's a, just know sometimes when that jump is going to go wrong. Nice, perfect. And I'm going to get these rings. I'm not going to hit these saws. This is going to be a near perfect run. I can't claim perfect. And I've already screwed up. So, near perfect. Not even close to near perfect. It will be a run. <laughs> we'll say that. Ooh. Nice save. Nope. Let's just get in there. All right, Firefly fight. Got you. No rings, but... Oh, I got them both. Thank you, thank you. Am I doing this Robotnik fight correct, though? I don't think I am. Or do I just gotta wait and he stops spinning on his own anyways? Yeah, he's... Okay. But I'm still not doing it right. Oh, I thought I could get that second hit. Well, I learned that from now. You can't. Alright, so wait. So it comes down, then you can safely, you gotta take a hit, lose some rings, but I should be able to recoup them. All right, I had to sneeze there for a second. What the? I wasn't even close to get crushed in there. And I'm already not doing good. But I still want that one up.
can't get over that guy. Ooh, no, took too long. Mm. Oh, why did I do that? And I missed a ring. Oh, come on. Oh, so close. These fireflies are a pain in the ass. Oh, come on. Got you. Too early. Come on, come on, come on. I get some good setups, I'm just doing it way too early. See you later. Botnik battle. Alright, so wait for him to come down to us. This little spinny bot thing. What the hell? I got greedy. I gotta get up there. Ooh, wow, I did that without invincibility. Cool. I gotta get to Robotnik with more rings. I gotta take the fireflies down without getting hit. Ooh, nice, nice. So far, this has been the best run, which means I'm going to do something to screw it up. <laughs> like that. <laughs> so much for my best run. Takes one move to turn it all to crap. Try to slip in there and get those rings. What the? <laughs> the platforms were spinning. Just at the right time, I just went right through them to the empty pit. I'm so grateful for this one up. Oh, I didn't go back for that one ring. Nope. 
<laughs> Alright, both these previous two levels have been giving me a hard time. Let me land safely somewhere. No. <laughs> thought I could get in there. I thought wrong. Get in there. One, two rings, rotate around, and firefly fight. Got you. I didn't take a hit. Nice. Sweet. And I've got... 31 rings against Robotnik. Why do I go for the double hit? <laughs> no! Oh, I wasn't expecting those to fall down. <laughs> what are you laughing at, Robotnik? If I wasn't impatient, I would have had that one. I am overall definitely getting a little better, although I still make some of the same dumb mistakes like with this saw. Oh, I thought I was in a safe spot. Not as many rings, but still. Oh. Got you. One down at least, and I have no rings. Oh. That wouldn't have been good. I didn't have enough rings, I don't think, for that. Well, I'm probably not doing that Robotnik fight right anyways. I mean, I haven't seen a Robotnik fight where it was mandatory to have to take damage, so I am sure there's something I'm not doing right. Nice, got there relatively quickly. Nice. 
Nice. Oh, come on, I should have got him. I didn't want to take that hit. Got you, punk. All right, Robotnik. There's some warm ups here. Out of curiosity, what if I don't hit him? What happens? And he kind of flies at me. So it seems like I gotta hit hit him. But still, it seems kind of weird if I'm ma mandatory to take a hit, so I still don't think I'm doing it right. Oh, managed to get that ring just in the nick of time. Come on, I can get him. I can get this bastard. Get the ring, get the ring. No ring. Oh, but I still got him. Screw you, Robotnik. You finally went down in this level. Dr. Eggman got served. Oh, stage is clear, so that was the end. And we got ourselves a nice little video to end the game. Why does Sonic look scared to like touch her when he's like backing away like, I'm not gonna hurt you. Is that supposed to be his girlfriend? He's got some little gem crystal thing in his hand. Looks like a flying jet ski. Sonic throwing a rock at him? <laughs> He's throwing a rock. Why did it look like that rock launched from the ground from a distance? <laughs> And we got ourselves some credits. So, I don't think we will be doing anything else today because that game, I, I, I thought it went really fast in the beginning, but then those last two episodes definitely kind of were giving me a little more of a challenge. And, uh, so, I think this might be it for today. While these credits are rolling, I will take this opportunity. We are going to go look for somebody to raid. Of in that community, I've raided a bunch of them recently, so let's check out Stream Troopers. Who do we have streaming on this group? Apid Metal, I did him recently. There's Fridge Punch. Fridge Punch has one viewer. And he is playing some Fortnite. We will send the love to him. in there 
I'm not sure how much longer these credits will go for, but we will let them sit around. And that appears to be it, sounds like it. Ooh, no, there's something more. Oh, try again. Maybe because I didn't accomplish every little aspect, I guess. I don't know. Like, get all the, the gems or whatever and stuff. See you next game. Looks like I got Tails unlocked. Little Tails. Alright, so that is it. Thank you, everybody. It has been fun. Oh, my camera got misaligned again. <laughs> it's been fun playing some Retro Sonic games. So, I will be back tomorrow night, 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And not entirely sure what I'm going to play yet, but it will be, will be a new game. So, we're going to try out something new tomorrow. But I will be back, 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I will see you then. I want to thank everybody. I want to thank Joker Lover for stopping by with the bits. I want to thank... Who else? I want to catch everybody real quick. Yeah, Joker Lover with the 10 bits. I appreciate that so much. Shinobi Nando, how did I forget you? Um, thank you for stopping by and awesome. That's the one I was thinking of, but I forgot about Shinobi Nando. Awesome. Thank you for stopping by. Shinobi Nando, thank you for stopping by. And Mrs. Pasta Lover, thank you for stopping by. So, let us initiate our raid. We are going to send some love to Fridge Punch, and I will see everybody tomorrow. Hopefully I won't be late like I was yesterday. Thank you all, and have a great night.